right, here's the video review for Kamen Rider Drive TK03 Type Wild. Uh, this is the third in the Tire Kokan series, and it is his new upgraded form Type Wild with the Wild Tire, the Type Wild Tire, and it comes with the Rumble Dump Tire as well. Um, and you can see it's a, it's a much different visual upgrade than some of the Gaim characters got. He, he goes mostly black uh, with some of the, you know, the red and white, or red and blue police light looking things here um just showed up this week in, the, in this week's episode and uh we'll be around there's still a couple more forms coming he's all silver on the back but yeah he's got a, he's got a much beefier helmet he's supposed to be more of an off-roady tire um just a more power than his standard speed form uh, he also comes with i believe they're calling this the handle ken uh the steering sword whatever they're calling it uh this is what the forms from a steering wheel he's got the you know the he does have a gun that forms from the door, but that hasn't come with a figure yet. Maybe it'll come with type technique. I don't know. But, uh, but yeah, yeah, rather than have the uh, tire form the torso, the tire just plugs in here on the shoulder um, like that. That's the base form without a tire on it. Um, now, this end cap does come off, and I found that it's probably easiest before you put a tire on it, just pop that off and pop it back on. It mostly pops off, so when you attach the rumble dump, uh, that you can see there's a tab there on the... Uh, on the drill itself so when you plug it in it plugs all the way in and stays on you can rotate it that way i thought you could rotate it that way but i guess not hmm i thought they showed pictures of it in the instructions turned but uh it allows it allows for the plug for the rumble dump uh just to show you this piece come off oh i see i see what it's supposed to do it, it plugs in here get the tire on there's a gear here and uh and this plugs in onto that plug and when you turn the tire you see when you turn the tire it turns that drill that's cool so you can rev the tire around the drill it's kind of cool now uh, this can also be uh if you move the handle can you can also pop this off and uh, have them hold it as like a hand weapon as well and put that cap back on and it spins freely like it does on drive. Go ahead and pop that off. And he works with all the previous tires. You can put uh, Funky Spike. Uh, they all just snap on right there. Again, you, you, you can put them on over this cap. You don't have to take this cap off. But there's just a little bit of friction. And I'm afraid that if I keep popping the tires on and off over the cap, it's going to scrape the paint off. Uh, but but that is designed to pop off, so it makes it a little easier, so you're not damaging your figure. But there he is with uh, Justice Hunter. Although Justice Hunter is missing his his grill. Oh, it's on the floor over here. And of course, he can obviously use the weapons. Uh, he can throw a massive monster off the floor. He's a monster. Who cares? Um, but yeah, there's uh, with uh, Max Flair. And uh, you can get this, you kind of have to move his uh, elbow out of the way in the right position, but you can get it to spin without nicking it uh, with all the flames out. Midnight Shadow. I'm not going to do, do all the tires. But, uh, but, yeah, and also on top of that, um, all the tires are compatible with drive as well. Uh, so you can take him... Have him fall over dead. Focus lock this thing. Um, but you can take the rumble dump tire, plug it on to drive, and again, he can hold that weapon since it's not geared uh, for his, you know, to work on him. He can use the weapon like that. Let's see if we can get that to focus a little better so it's not quite as bright. Doesn't look like it's going to happen. But uh, you can kind of see there the detail on that thing. The yellow is really bright. And so he can use the rumble dump tire as well as the type wild tire, which I, which I kind of like because it gives him a little bit more of a, gives the regular drive more of a rough and ready look. I kind of like that versus the, I guess, I think, I think maybe I just like the silver stripe versus the red stripe, but uh, you can use that tire. And of course you can use his regular tire on type wild as well. Let's get him here side by side comparison in their standard forms. So there's Type Wild with uh, Drive. And again, the sword can also be used. Uh, drive can hold it just as easily. 
It's just a matter of wrapping his fingers around it. There you go. Actually, I think he holds it a little better. But, uh, but yeah, there, there's the two of them together. Drive and his new upgraded form. Uh, TK03 Type Wild. And the little thing I want to point out too as well, the shoulders on this one actually pull out to allow the, the bigger shoulder pads some, some clearance. Uh, that, doesn't, that doesn't do that on Drive. Drive is just a standard shoulder, but uh, Type Wild does actually have pull out shoulders to give them a little bit more freedom of motion, which is cool, especially with this big, I guess mostly for this big old tire over here. So yeah, you got the standard points for articulation, uh, ball joint neck, uh, dual hinge shoulders, dual swivel shoulders, I guess, bicep swivel, um, actually, there we go. There's a bicep swivel. Uh, there's actually a forearm swivel. You can kind of see that uh, rotating around there. Uh, hinge elbow. Wrist swivel. Opening fingers. The first two and the second two are separate fingers, but they're all one-piece fingers. Uh, no, oh, yeah, there's a waist swivel. Uh, ball joint hip. You know, there's actually double swivel hips. Uh, double thigh swivel, hinge knee, ball joint uh, ankles. So, again... You know, the figure arts are better overall, but uh, these little gimmick toys are really starting to get some nice articulation in them as well. So there's Type Drive or Drive Type Wild uh, TK03. The tire next tire set comes out, um, and then we get uh, Machine Chasers weapons, so that's going to be cool. Well, there you go. I got it from CS Toys. Thanks, guys, again, and I'll see you when all that uh, Machine Chaser stuff comes out.